Hello children. Welcome to Edurel. Today we are going to solve few questions on the topic adaptations in plants. We will be solving and will be discussing in detail the solutions of each and every question. Let's begin with the first question that is why do plants need to adapt and the options are to survive to protect both or none of them the correct answer is option a to survive let's have a look on the solution plants need to adapt in order to survive harsh climatic conditions for example there is this rose plant it is very weak but it is having thorns on the stems so that it is protected from the attacks of animals and humans so rose plant has adapted to the harsh climatic condition here is another example of cactus plant cactus plant does not have leaves but it is having spines which are stronger than leaves also the roots of the cactus plants are able to absorb more and more rain water desert plants like cactus have adapted to the harsh climatic condition of deserts so the correct answer is option a let's come to the next question which is what are terrestrial plants and the options are plants that grow in water plants that grow on land both or none of them the correct answer is plants that grow on land are called terrestrial plants that means option b now there are different types of terrestrial plants depending on the condition they grow in let's discuss them one by one first type of terrestrial plants is plants of hills or which are found on mountains for example pine tree deodar tree cedar tree etc the second type of terrestrial plants are plants of plains which are peepal tree banyan tree mango tree sal tree etc both of them plants of hills and plants of plains are called terrestrial plants because plains are land and hills are land also the next type of plants are evergreen plants they are also terrestrial plants as they are grown on land and not in water the examples are tea plant coffee plant rubber plants this is an image of a coffee plant the next type of plant is plants in deserts example cactus babool etc deserts are also land so plants in deserts are also terrestrial plants hence the correct answer is option b let's continue with the third question which is tall straight and needle like leaves bearing plant grows on option a plains option b mountains option c both of them option d none of these the correct answer is mountains let's see how you can see here this is an image of a pine tree and it is conical in shape and it is tall and straight as well why because in case of any snow on mountains the snow falls here the snow falls on the top and can quickly slide down whereas if there was no conical shape the snow would have rested on the leaves of the tree so these trees have adapted to the conditions of the mountains and they are tall straight and conical shaped also the leaves of the trees are needle like if the leaves were broad snow would have rested on it 
but middle like leaves made it easier for the tree to survive the harsh climatic conditions hence the correct option is option b tall straight and middle like leaves are found on plants that grow on mountains the next question is pine fir and deodar and spruce are good examples of conifers ornamental plants both or none of these the correct answer is option a conifers conical trees are also known as conifers or mountain trees and they are tall straight cone shaped with needle like leaves i have discussed this in the earlier question as well that tall straight and cone shaped with needle like leaves are found in mountains in this question we got to know that conical trees are also known as coniferous you can see the word conical resembles with the word coniferous c o n i c o n i and this means mountain trees you can see a pine tree here tall straight cone shaped and with needle like leaves here is the image of a fir tree again it is tall straight cone shaped and having leaves which are needle like similarly the image of a cedar tree cone shaped tall and straight with needle like leaves similarly the spruce tree cone shaped tall and straight with needle like leaves hence all these are examples of conifers or mountain trees okay children in the next slide we will be discussing more questions on the same topic till then you can visit the course science for class 4 in adorif and can solve various tests and can watch various videos can see various documents and chapter notes in order to understand this chapter adaptations in plants clearly thank you so much and let's meet in the next video